Wow. You guys. Oh, but if we're what? waiting for them, wouldn't we you guys have get your the advantage? I mean, they're charging at you as you're like waiting for them. So you kind of like you get your attacks at the same time that they get their attacks. All the combat. I know, but at the we're same time. like waiting for them. They're like. But they, they know they, they know you're waiting for them, so they can swing as you're running, as they're running at you, and you can swing as they're running at like. You would go at the same time, right? Like, correct yeah. me if I'm wrong, but if I'm running at you to punch you in the face, I don't know. If I had to you... board a ship, just the fact to jump on That's the ship, true. like I feel like I would be ready before they would. That's kind of true. Like once they're trying to get on board, doesn't that like hinder kind of like a high ground advantage? You mean? Like, I don't, I, we're just here I mean, waiting. The, the dock, have to the dock and the, the ship dock. are at roughly the same level. So it's a very simple matter to just, like, hop onto the ship. Not but to only that up would give us, like, a second advantage, no? But they could attack mid-hop. Well, then they would their attack would be minus something, because they're hopping. Wouldn't it? As much as I want that to be true, I think Neil's right. Well, I don't know. It's not their ground. They're trying to get on board here. Just let me put it this way. If we rule it that way, then anytime you try and hop on someone else's ship, you're going to get a penalty to attack as well. I'm just like, trying to I just, imagine, All like, things must I'm... work. I was going to say yeah. no penalty because in the end, it doesn't really matter whether someone gets a penalty or not because, you know, then you'll be in that situation one day and then you'll end up getting that penalty. So yeah, I was and just I was going to simplify and not do penalties. If you would have told me, hey, you're boarding a ship, you're at a penalty. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I'm actually like, honestly, if I'm running down a dock, and I'm trying to get somebody on a ship, and I have this momentum, and they're just waiting for me, and I jump with my sword onto their ship, I feel like I have a lot of advantage there. I don't. I, first of all, I've never seen a ship the same height as it's a It's not dock. quite the same height. It is a slight yeah. difference. Yeah. If it's a little higher, then the plank would be like this, and they would... Like, yeah. Uh, it's a slight and difference. I was going to kind of... Agree try and simplify some of the combat mechanics rather than have like bonuses and penalties for everything like okay. I mean, that, that's a legit argument to make and also we broke like the pier a little bit i don't know if that's changed that was way way, way back I was that behind doesn't... them i yes. shot too far okay. all right let's I, just go off this is i should have broken the dock i thought about it but then i was too excited to hit the archer okay yeah. let's go even to the one that yeah. hits hammer fist um, rolls for damage. He crits Hammerfist for six. Hammerfist has... But then, wouldn't Lily cast it right before they get on? And they can attack this? Everyone's initiative was at the... Well, I mean, like, Lily's hiding underneath them, so she can't oh, cast yeah. it until they jump over her. Yeah. Okay. That's true. So Hammerfist gets critted for six. He has five, six, seven, eight, nine life, so he's at three. I should write down that he has nine life somewhere. No, He's not alive. I don't want him to die. Neil, you can kill the others with him. <laughs> okay, uh, he's at three, uh, and he makes his critical resistance check and passes. Nice. Faye. Uh, yeah, not they... not you, Faye. Other Faye. Um. Which is confusing, but he gets crit as well. Actually, I think that is. Yeah, we need to kill other Fae. Double... <laughs> that is a double crit against other Fae. Ooh, and he takes 11, 12, yeah. and he only had. Oh, he had 8 life, so he's only at negative 4. We're gonna need to patch up some people real quick. <laughs> um, What's the other one? Brand. That's an attack against Brand, which is just a single hit. Seven against Brand, seven. So Brand drops to zero, exactly. And this one against Faye is not a crit because you're high C. And you take two, Faye. So you have taken nine. You are at 10 HP. And let's return the fire. Faye, would you make your attack against one of these warriors? But all our guys going down get an attack in, right? Everyone gets an attack in, yeah. Okay, cool. Just making sure. 15 is a hit. Nice. Roll for damage. 10. Shit. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Yeah, so that means... Do that. Okay. You hit him for 10. He takes a boatload of... Oh! Chainmail, right. So he takes 3 less. But di didn't Ileana cast whatever on me? That's yeah, right. That's true. Plus 2 to strength. Good call. Uh, so... That would increase your damage bonus by 4. So 14? So 14. 14. And it would... Okay, that stuff doesn't matter. Yeah, so 14. Yeah. Excellent. Um, Hammerfist swings at his opponent. Rolls at 19 plus 3. How much damage did I do to the guy? You did 14 to the, your guy. Well, he has right. chainmail, so yeah, minus 3, so 11. Left. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Hammerfist rolls at 22 total. Holy shit. Uh, and Hammerfist! Unlike his name, Hammerfist is using a saber, which is d6 plus 1. So he does 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 damage. Ha! Nice. Right. doesn't mess around. <laughs> That's our first mate. I love Hammerfist, man. What's his strength score? Does he? I don't have stats for Hammerfist. Do I? No, no strength. Bonus. We'll just leave it as this. Okay. Um, brings the guy down. Uh, minus three for the armor. And Brand gets a swing. He misses. And other Fae. Ah! Oh god, no! No! Other Fae. Other Fae. Other Fae makes his attack. And rolls 17 plus 1 is 18, which is just a hit. And he hits for 1 against a guy that's already on fire, so it doesn't matter. Okay, and initiatives for everyone involved. Okay, <laughs> that's I'm, still live. I'm, I'm chill touching. Can I already do an initiative that I haven't gotten off? Yes, you are going at 46, and we're at 40 right now. Okay. Five. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm activating chill touch. Lily Dudley goes at five. Okay, I think that's everyone. <laughs> okay, Archer 2. Takes a shot at December. Which rolls a I one. was just about to say when I got the chance that I was taking cover. Because I got I three. Neil, not... anymore. So you I'm like what? behind the ballista, not trying to load it anymore. Say so you got three? Yeah. Okay, sorry. I don't know how it got to five. Nice. Good catch. Um, I guess you go at the same time as that archer does. Uh, he fails his save and gets a penalty to two to attack. 13 is a miss. Well, oh. you, it's a cuff off the chain mail. Roll for initiative. Not bad. Four. It's good. Hammer fist and Drax. So Drax takes a bleeding damage. Mm. And Hammer fist swings, misses, and rolls for initiative. Oh, that's two steps. You need to roll plus three, not plus two. Oh, yeah. So it was cool. a 14, Neil. 14. Which is still... 15 is the number to hit. Okay. Uh, Lily, at 45, your turn. Okay, so chill touch activated. Okay. Uh, and then you just need to, to touch something? people. Do I need to roll something? What's the duration of chill touch? Three rounds plus run one round per level. Okay, so you just... you uh, Now all you have to do is touch people. Okay, so I'm gonna try to touch like the yeah, guy so who's like nearest. So roll initiative for touch, which would be just be D8 plus or D6 plus two. It's just a little three. 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 Uh, you three. would also get your ah. speed benefit for high dex. Oh shit! Of so, course. So it's like one. I'm It'd like, be two. It'd be two. Oh shit! That's cool. Um, December, you get your shot as. El Eliana gets her shot with the light ballista. Okay. Eliana, who are you aiming at? There are two fighters 
fighting like um, in and amongst your troops. And then there's the archer way in the back. The archer. Okay. Roll to hit d20 plus 8. And December, same for you at the same moment. Oh, Holy shit, crap, Eliana. You did the exact nice. same thing. You, I mean, <laughs> wow. roll max stamp. Roll, what the hell did you do? 8, 8d6. Yeah, awesome. So I roll 8 Dead. Six. Yeah. Uh, dead dead on fire. Dead 35. Yay. Oh, crap. Yay. Yeah, you pierce him through, like, the torso, like, on the left side, like, grabbing his shoulder, and he spins around, and the bolt flips around, and he tumbles into the water, and the ballista uh, bolt gets, like, wedged in kind of part of the dock, and just hanging off the dock. Um, <laughs> at the same time, December fires her crossbow bolt at the same guy. <laughs> <laughs> Roll the hit, December. Has she changed, like, aim? I already like, did. Bonus? It's D t- D20 plus oh, 3, Oh, 22. Right? Right you double crit as well? His body. <laughs> well, I mean, you guys, your shots go off at the same time, so it's like, yeah. little ching and then, like, giant <laughs> <laughs> Um, But still, you get to roll five. You get to roll three D... Three? Six. Six, six. Okay. Nice. Which was enough to kill him anyway, so you, like, shot him in the face while she shot him in, like, the torso and just wrecked. It's all hell. <laughs> bye bye. Uh, December and Eliana, what are your actions? I'm gonna stay because on the ship, there I'm on. I'm still on that ballista platform, mm-hmm. and the melee fighters are still coming onto the ship, like on the lower deck, right? Right. Okay, so I'm gonna stay up there, kind of like at a good vantage point to keep shooting down at them. I'm gonna keep shooting my. Would my dagger range be good enough to get them? Can she um, get a flank? Like you can get daggers. a flanking attack. You could throw daggers as well. And my range would be good enough. And yeah, I can reload range. daggers fast. I can reload daggers faster than I can my crossbow, correct? Yes. Okay, so I'm going to keep doing that. So, uh, do I roll anything different for throwing daggers than I do for um Nope, stabbing? everything's the same. But okay, you get so the I'm going to dual bonus. wield them again. Oh, flank, flank. flank. What's my flank bonus? Plus 1. Okay, so that means for my right hand, it's D D twenty plus, plus four. Three, oh, three plus one. Plus yeah. And okay, then for and the left the hand, it would be D twenty okay. plus two. Yeah. Okay. So my initiatives. Ooh, oh, one nice. Is... One. Wow. Forty-six. One December. Right. Forty-six and four. Eliana, what are you doing now? Um. Okay, did she just kill the other person? No, you guys shot the same person. Oh, okay. Um. There's no archers. There's survivor. two fighters left. Yeah, I want to shoot one of the chainmail guys. That's like up With your fighting. Light ballista. Yeah. Okay, so roll D8 plus 16 for initiative. Okay. Oh, wow. Wow. Huh. Okay, December, Faye, and Lily, you all go at the same time. December with your left hand. So I'm just D4, right? Oh, that's shitty. Faye, you miss. Uh, Lily, no, you're D20 plus... plus... Oh, but I'm touching them. Plus three and two for back attack, so D20 plus five. Really? Yeah. For... Touching them? Yeah, it's a normal melee attack with plus two bonus for back attack. 22? Doesn't matter, you can't do crit damage since it's just ma- oh, it's magic. Oh, wow, it's so lame. I hate that attack now, it sucks. But you only need to roll a 10 to hit them. You, you ignore oh, okay. armor. Good point, good point. So just d4. Yeah. No arcane bonus damage, nothing. Uh, I don't know, what's the damage on... It says 1d4. Well then, include your arcane bonus. You get that on all die rolls. Okay, cool. Plus two. Four damage. Four damage and lose one point of strength. Yeah. Oh, and he loses, loses one point of strength. Yes. Yeah. And then I want to just touch him until he dies. So that's basically uh, what I'm doing. Pick which warrior uh, warrior one or warrior two. Pick one right now. Huh? 
pick well, the where... one I'm already touching. Yeah, yeah, but which one is that number? Just give me a number. I'm, I'm asking for random number generator. One or two? Okay. One. One. Okay. You t grab him on the ankle, and he shivers with cold, and you see like his blood drain from the extremities as he collapses to the deck. Oh well, then I touch number two. Yeah. Well, now roll initiative to attack number two. Eight. Eight. And. Ooh, I think it was just plus one. Those and oh, and my dexterity, so just six, I just think. Six. Okay. Faye. I initiative. thought you wanted. I thought you wanted to keep one alive. Is there just one left? There's only yes. one left. Oh well. Yes. Neil? Then Neil, I won't do it. I will say, drop your weapon. You're the last one standing. And I'll point at him, like, menacingly with the chill touch. <laughs> uh, yeah, he surrenders. He's vastly okay. outnumbered. Okay, so... Bind him! Yeah, bind we bind him. him. I don't touch him, because I'm going to kill him if I touch him. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, nobody touches me! <laughs> nobody touch me. Okay, he drops his weapon. Um, you have Drax and Fake Fae who are bleeding to death. Okay, Ileana, go save them. Maybe. At least patch him. And okay. Drastic, more drastically wounded, right? So him first. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, Ileana, can you... I have another heal. Time? Yeah, roll initiative for your heal. Yeah, I have another one. Uh, Which one are you healing? D plus four, that brings you to eight... Seven. Oh yeah, you can get to him in time. You can get to him just in time, actually. He was a... Yeah. Oh. Um, roll okay. d8 plus 1 for healing damage. Should be a negative okay. at this point. Healing damage? Or healing anti-damage. Yeah. <laughs> Eat. Nice. Okay, cool. Nice. He's only at negative 1, and he will recover fine. The other guy is slowly bleeding to death, though. Okay, and I'm going to patch him up. Okay. And you have a trained healer, so don't worry about it. He's at negative 7. Okay, the so last guy... I guess... Ooh, yeah. The last guy is stuck. And then I'm like, see your frozen body over here? You could be frozen too. <laughs> he puts his hands down on his sides, drops weapons. Hey, you have the rope. Tie him up. <laughs> um, I hobble down. Are any of, is anybody else coming after us? Yes. Then we should leave. Why, why are people coming after us? Are you guys... Brigus? We heard about... Word travels fast. We heard about your discussion with the queen and your betrayal. What betrayal? Our betrayal of what? You spoke names. You named names. You Whoa. disclosed plans. Those names never tried to align with us. They said, just stay out of business. And you didn't stay, stay out, out of our business. You well, intentionally got involved in our business. And now you will be hunted to the ends of the earth and back. Oh, that sucks. Who are you? We're being hunted by whom? Can anyone talk to us? We would have probably allied with you, you fucking idiot. Just talk to <laughs> us. Stop being like, oh, we're so secretive. We're like, blah, 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 blah. Talk to us. We're actually trying to make a deal with you, but we couldn't find anyone. Yeah. True story. I work for... Shit. Damn it, hold on. Let me look up their name. I can't I keep blanking on their name. I work for the Ivan Guard. The Ivan Guard. We are a organization that works from within the shadows, usually. And we. I, I, there's no real term for what we do, but we make things happen. We. We arrange things that are, would otherwise be impossible to arrange, and we, you know, set up encounters, we set up meetings, we set up, I don't know, assassinations of kings, 
we set Are you up mercenaries. Do you do this for money? For money and for our own ends to secure ourselves a better future. 